یا محمد رسول الله یا محمد رسول الله یا محمد رسول الله The Iranian army's air defense kicked off its annual drills, dubbed Defenders of Velayat Skies. Held over a 400,000 square kilometer area in central Iran, the military exercise saw the use of a range of air defense missile systems, UAVs, electronic warfare systems, and radars. This year, the maneuvers focused on protecting the country's strategic areas, where the Persian Gulf and the Strait of Hormuz were simulated as the conflict zones. In the first phase of the drill, we successfully conducted reconnaissance missions against our mock enemy. We designed the drills in a way that resembled the real warfare, in order to test our capabilities when the real enemy attacks our sensitive places. The drills are expected to use Iranian domestically manufactured air defense equipment. For the first time, 15th of Hordad missile system has been deployed to the drill site. The air defense system is capable of tracking and destroying air targets flying at medium altitudes. Talash and Mirsad missile systems were also used in the drills, where they successfully hit mock enemy drones. All of the key military hardware used in this maneuver are made indigenously by our experts. We showed that the sanctions have only made us stronger. Today, no one dares to attack Iran because they are well aware of our military capabilities. With over four decades of arms embargo imposed against the country by the West, Iran has had no way but to stand on its own feet to build up its military arsenal. Today, Iran says over 80% of its defense equipment are indigenous. Iran's army says with its domestic air defense equipment, Iran's skies are safer than ever. Meanwhile, Army commander here say Iran will never initiate a war against any country, and its military might serves only defensive purposes. Yusuf Jalali Prosivi from the location of the drill in Semnan Pro.